Terminal Annex building on the northeast corner of Dealey Plaza. We're here with Mr. J.C. Price, the engineer in charge of the building. Mr. Price, where were you at the time that the presidential motorcade drove through Dealey Plaza? Well, I went up to the roof and uh, where I'd get a better view of the cabin. Is this where you were sitting on November 22nd, Mr. Price? Yes, sir. Right here? Right here on this spot. And where did you think you heard the shots come from? From behind the overpass over there. Uh, triple overpass. That's where I thought the shots were coming from. And where did you see the man run? Over behind that wooden fence. Past the cars and over behind the Texas Depository Building. Did you give that information to the Dallas Sheriff's Department on the very day of the assassination? Yes, I did. Now, I'd say in about 30 minutes after the assassination. Were you ever called as a witness by the Warren Commission? No, sir. No, sir. <laughs> I show you this map published by the Warren Commission of the Dealey Plaza area and ask you if you would mark on it where you thought the shots came from. Yes, yes, sir. That's just behind the wooden fence where it joins the overpass, is that correct? That is correct. We're now here more than two years after the assassination. Now, where do you think the shots came from on November 22nd? Well, I can't be sure. Uh, it seems that uh, from all information that's been gathered that uh, the shots came from the, the Texas Boat Depository, but I can't hardly believe that. Uh, although I never did look over there at the building, but really I think that the shots came from that direction. It seems that everything pointed to that that fact that they came from the book depository building, but I can't buy that right now. <laughs> That's about it. <laughs> May I have your name, please?